Nutrition is foundational to what I do and what I advise on, of course, and that that does influence your hormones and neurotransmitters, your your immune system, your digestive tract, etc. But there are other elements of nutritional therapy that other people don't understand or aren't aware of. And so during an initial consultation, what I'll be asking are, are, are questions that seemingly aren't relevant, such as what's your lifestyle like? What are your relationships like? Do you enjoy your work? And what I'm trying to get at is lifestyle influences that are impacting on your health in some way or another it's necessary to ask about connections and relationships and how someone deals with life day to day because it does impact on their stress levels their hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis their their stress levels their their neurotransmitters their hormones their their cortisol levels and cortisol as we all know as most of you probably know is a fat retainer so if your cortisol levels are high all the time because you're very stressed and you have no support no support system then of course that's going to be working against you that's an uphill battle to, in order to lose the weight if, you, if that's what your goal is, if that's what you're looking for. So I always consider lifestyle and that is very much part of the functional medicine, uh, nutritional therapy. That's how it's distinguished away from nutritionists that would work for the NHS, for example. They are in the business of working in public health and, 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 uh, and group cohorts, whereas it's personalised medicine for me. It's personalised nutrition. I want to understand my client, understand where they're coming from, where their weak points are, understand how I can then tailor and, and cater the plan to, to work with them um, and course correct where I feel that perhaps they need to put a little bit more effort into it or um, where we can habit stack. So where they're already, they already have a relatively good habit, now we can just kind of finesse and tweak it and add something on top of it so that we're not, I don't know, overloading the client too much at the beginning. 